guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is going to be a small haul. With us having a lockdown, we had our first day out within two weeks um, to go food shopping and we were surprised actually that a couple of pound shops was open. So we did do little bits and bobs that we really, really needed. Um, so let's just get on with this. Um, we'll start off with the boring things, I guess, first, which would be two packs of women's stuff. Um, these, even though they did come from the pound shop, was £1.50 each. So that's them. Not really much more to say about that. We all know how they go. Then we did end up picking some baby wipes up, which was a pound. Um, I use these to remove makeup. We also have a toddler. So, yes. My stepson is a toddler, so he has to have them. Bless him. Then we got Roxy some food. She's already had one of these. Um, these, I think, are two for a pound, so we ended up getting four. This is her favourite meal. Um, it is the Ses... Kessa, I can never say it, classics anyway, it's in chicken and turkey, it's that one. We then needed some air freshener for the bathroom. So we've got the Odor Eliminator in Clean Scent, I don't know, so that's that one, that was a pound. So we've got that. Then we got a Rio drink, this was a pound also, um, in, in Tropical, this is my other half's. Actually it was pound nineteen. it says there on the bottle. Uh, but yeah, he loves this. It is his favourite drink, so he picked that one up. We got a booklet of 280 tattoos, um, obviously for kids. So we got this for my stepdaughters. Um, yeah, my fiancé has six kids, so yeah. Some of these are going to be for them, and then some going to do some like... You know like when you just want to know what a tattoo looks going to look like on you? So I'd rather try that and then see if it looks okay and then I'm going to go and get it. Like I like the look of this one, maybe across the bottom of my neck. I think that looks pretty cool, but I want to see what it looks like first. Uh, but things like this one and all of them, the kids are going to love them. So that's that. We also managed to get some hand sanitizer at last for a pound. It has been really, really hard to get hold of this stuff, but we managed to get that one. Then I got a bottle of aloe vera. It is the original flavour one. You can also get this in strawberry. This was a pound. Um, the strawberry one I'm not so keen on, but the aloe vera is absolutely gorgeous. And if you don't know, it does have the actual chunks of aloe vera in the drink. So be aware, they are like jelly proper, not like jelly, but they're the it's proper aloe vera in there basically and it's absolutely delicious and so good for you as well then we got some bubble bath uh, my other half has problems with his legs so i thought that we would get the radox for men muscle therapy in black pepper and ginseng whatever that is i do not know but this is a 500 ml bottle for one pound fifty We've never tried this one before. Let's have a smell. Haven't even smelt it yet. Yeah, it just smells like normal men's bubble bath. <laughs> smells a bit like um, Ted Baker men's bubble bath. Really, really nice. We then got some senna. Now, for those of you that don't know, these are actually £1.29 from the pound shop. But for those of you that don't know, I do have a little bit of an addiction when it comes to these. Um, yeah, it's a little bit of a problem. I may do a video on it, a bit of an awareness video, but I do have an addiction with those. If you don't know what they are for, they help you to go to the toilet. So then I got some body mist in watermelon. This smells so good. I smelt it before I even bought it. Oh, smells so fresh, so clean and gorgeous. I love it. If I could drink it, I would. Not recommended. Don't do it, but it was a pound. Then we've got some plasters. You get a hundred assorted different plasters in here. We do need plasters. As I say, I have six stepkids. Um, you know, they're here like every other weekend. He 
even half of the school holidays and accidents happen. And even accidents happen for me. I did end up cutting my finger on a knife and we had no plasters, so we got them. My other half, unfortunately, is allergic to plasters, so that's a bit of a... But yeah. I got two bits of makeup here. I got one liquid eyeliner by W7 which is that one, it's just black, so I'm not even gonna open it because I don't want it contaminated yet. That was a pound. And then we got a purple lipstick. How beautiful is this lipstick? Can we just say this right now? Now this I will open. I'm not gonna swatch it because as you know, there is a virus going around right now. And I just, I don't know, I'm just really, really funny about, about it at the minute. But this is the brand Saffron and that is that color right there. I will use it in a makeup tutorial video, I guess. Um, also, talking of that, that was a pound, by the way, but also we will have some makeup videos coming because, as I keep saying, we're on a lockdown and we're limited with videos and I just feel like, because we're on lockdown, I need to make the most of this time to just think of some really good ideas for videos and get them done because I really have been slacking and I can't apologise enough for that. So... Next thing that we got, moving on, um, was Pot Puree in Fluffy Towel. Never tried this one before, and it is very, very rare that I ever buy this stuff, to be quite fair and honest with you. It was £1.29, good little bargain for such a huge bag. We won't be putting all this bag into a pot or whatever we decide to use. I'll probably just use half a bag, because, as you guys know, I am a huge lover of candles and... The scenty sticks, aroma sticks, um, oils, plugins. I like all that stuff because that's really, really strong. But I always find that when you use this stuff, it doesn't really give a really strong scent off. Like I can put the whole bag out and to me, it will not fill my room full of scent. Not enough scent that makes me happy. And I like using the aroma sticks because they really calm me down. And yeah, just give me a fresh mind and chance to chill out the next thing that I did pick up or we picked up um, I just want to say before I actually show this we do not do drugs we do not recommend doing drugs we are totally against drugs um, so please don't think that we got this for any drug purpose at all we did not we bought this next thing that I'm going to show you for diamond art painting and I'll explain that in a minute so basically it is a weed grinder now this is just a really really tiny one uh this was i think it was either one pound 99 or two pound 99 uh, they did do bigger plastic ones and they did the metal ones so on and so forth but we don't want a metal one because it's going to break the diamonds so we got a small one um but yeah i just want to make it pretty clear that we do not do drugs and we are totally against it um so yeah i just wanted to make that clear but um yeah the reason why we put diamonds in here because sometimes the diamonds get stuck and i'll talk a little bit more about that when i start doing a lot more videos and i will have a lot more diamond painting videos coming as well showing you how to prepare to do a diamond painting explaining where you, the best places you can buy them how to look after them how to seal them press them frame them everything's going to be coming um so yeah the next four items i'm going to show you now is candies and these was a pound a bag so the first one that we got is strawberry flavored sugar free i might add as well um diablo diablo i hope that's how you say it if not i've just made myself look like a fool but anyway they are these strawberry and cream candies sugar free and i've had these ones before and they are delicious and as you all know i've had weight loss surgery um i've not yet been to the doctors either to see if i've got fully rid of my diabetes yet and i can't go yet till this bloody lockdown is over with so i've got sugar free there we go then we've got another sugar free one in the same brand um cappuccino and cream these are my other halves um but yeah so you get 12, there's 12 in that one, and there's 13 in that one. Oh no, there isn't. Hold on, sorry, my bad. No, 
only 13 per sweet calories. Okay. I thought it was actually telling me how many was in these, but no. So the sugar intake is 0 0.02, salt is 0 0.02, saturates is 0 0.1, fats is 0 0.2. So if you're going to get them, even though they're sugar free, go easy guys, there's no need to be greedy, so that's them. My other half picked up some licorice blacks, 100% um, yummy by Finney. I think that's how you say it. I probably made a fool of myself again. We, I am dyslexic, as you all know. But um, yeah, these are rock hard. Um, at the minute, me and my fiance are actually going through a licorice and a sour sweet kick right now. Um, but licorice is massive in our home. So that's that. Oh, what else does it say here as well? Gluten free, which is good. Vegan friendly, brilliant. Um, no artificial flavours or colours. So there you go, that one's a really good one as well. And then I did go a little bit naughty and I bought some jelly beans. Now these aren't the proper cheap jelly beans, but they're not, they're also not the um, jelly bellies. They are by the same brand as the black licorice. Again, it just says 100% yummy. 0% grass of fat um sin gluten free so that's really really good sans gluten yeah so that's that um and in here you get strawberry cola pineapple no hold on so again strawberry cola pina colada watermelon lemon cherry orange raspberry green apple blackberry cream that's a new flavor cream never heard of that one Tutti Frutti, Mango, Pear, Pineapple, Vanilla and Peach. So I'm, I can't wait to try that. But again, I am going to go easy with these because they're quite sweet. So that is all of the haul, guys. I am so, 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 so sorry that it has took so long for me to do a haul. But again, it all comes down to lockdown. We have to respect the law and just do as I'm told and just stay safe. I cannot threat that enough, I cannot beg you all enough just to stay safe, only go out when necessary, only go out for your food shopping, paying bills or in emergencies, please do stay safe. Um, I've already had a family member fall seriously ill with it, I've already had a friend that has been rushed to hospital and it really was not looking good for him. But he's now, thank goodness, home and on ventilators and things at home. Uh, so, yeah, just be careful, guys. Wear your masks and gloves if you must go out. We also did buy gloves today, but I didn't think I'd show them in this haul. Um, also, my mum has very kindly sent us some masks today through the post. So, um, yeah, we haven't had any guests come round. We haven't had no communication whatsoever. Uh but yes, I'm going to start making plenty more videos, we're going to start catching up, I'm going to start kicking my own ass into touch with doing more videos for you guys, because I do realise and I do know that I really have been slacking, but ah, what do you do when you have depression? I don't know. I just haven't, like I'll wake up in the morning, I want to do a video and then I don't. It's like that all the time, like a roller coaster up and down, it's bloody awful. So I'm just going to start making myself do videos now. So we've got, as I say, plenty of makeup videos. I have a full bloody stack there of palettes we can get through. Uh, we're going to sort it. We're going to have a ball. We're going to do some amazing stuff. Okay, so I'm going to leave it there. That is the haul, guys. I really hope it wasn't too long or too short. I really hope I didn't go on a bit with a bit of this. But yeah, I just haven't done the video in that long. I just felt like I needed to chat with you guys. So thank you so much for watching. Please all do stay safe. Leave your comments down below and I'll be sure to get right back to you. And don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell button for notifications. And I will see you in my next haul. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye. Mwah.